Police closing out a missing persons case we first told you about this past weekend. 43-year-old Jordy Hudson, a local artist. She was last seen 10 days ago, but was reported missing just five days ago. After interviewing several people today, police said they arrested two people in connection with her death. Channel 4's Francesca Amaker joins us live from the St. John's County Jail. Francesca. Tom and Mary, the chief describes this incident as a tragedy that did not have to happen. Now Thomas and Branson sit right here at the St. John's County Jail for the murder of a woman that they didn't even know two weeks ago. According to investigators, it all began here at the Giggling Gator Pub, a popular hangout spot for St. Augustine locals. Officials say this is where 43-year-old Jody Hudson met 38-year-old John Branson on the night of April 9th. Hudson unaware that Branson would be charged with her death days later. Police say after Hudson was reported missing, officers began searching several locations along County Road 208. They quickly learned that Branson was the last person seen with Hudson, but police say he may not have been alone. We also located through her association with John Branson, a female by the name of Christine Thomas. And in the course of interviewing her, her statements led us to search warrants for the property and the residence in the 6,000 block of County Road 208. And, and, and actually an arrest warrant for John Harry Branson. Officials say Branson has been charged with murder and Thomas has also been charged with accessory to murder. Tuesday afternoon, Branson led detectives to this nearby residence where human remains were concealed underground. Remains believed to be Jody Hudson's. Our hearts go out to the family of Jody Hudson and they have asked that you please respect their privacy. And this time they're, they're obviously uh, stricken with grief. And this is not the first crime that these two have created or even been through. If we take a look at Hanson, excuse me, if we take a look at Branson's criminal background, it's pretty lengthy. So coming up at 11 o'clock, I take you into the background of both of these two now charged with murder and one charged with the accessory of murder. That's all new coming up at 11. For now, I'm live in St. John's County. Francesca Amaker, Channel 4, The Local Station.